Welcome back. Our small business spotlight shines this morning on Q Natural Good Look and Good and Put in out of Charleston with me is Quinetta Gooden who runs this multifaceted business. How are you doing this morning? Good morning. I'm doing great. I'm so elated. Today's my birthday, so I'm really, really, really. It's a good day. A great day. <laughs> that is awesome. So let's talk a little bit about your business. What is your businesses? What are they all about? Well, my bus business is um, Good and Put in. Mm -hmm. And that derived from my last name. Um, it came about um, about three years ago once COVID hit. Yeah. Um, kind of was down and needing something to get me back up, you know, and motivate me. Mm -hmm. And so my mom is the inspiration behind it all. Hi, good morning, mom. <laughs> she's at work. Um, she's a kitchen manager, so she couldn't be here this morning. Yeah. Um, but she is the brains behind this all and the push for me to keep going. Oh, so wow. That's the inspiration, inspiration, and she's infamous for making her banana pudding mm -hmm. in our hometown. And so one day I asked her, I said, Mom, do you mind helping yes. me make some banana pudding? Like, I'm not in the kitchen like her because that's her, her domain, mm -hmm. her ter ter territory. But she didn't hesitate. She showed me. And I'm like, well, what do you think about good and pudding? You know, keeping the name alive, creating generational wealth, mm -hmm. passing it down. And she's like, I love it. So... That's how that name come about in Good and Putting. So. Oh, I love that. That's Thank amazing. So, so this is kind of like a business that you've been able to do with your mom. And I could imagine that that's something so special that you've been able to cherish, you know, learning alongside her, using her recipe to make the banana pudding. I could imagine that that is just super special for very the two of you. Special, very special, very special, especially for her be able to take the time out to show me that, mm -hmm. to me ask her and she'd be selfless. So when we get in the kitchen and I ask her any tips, all of this comes from my mom yeah. and she is one of my greatest critiques. So <laughs> she's gonna tell me if it's this, if it's that, if it's too much, and I just love it. And it mm -hmm. has just brought our relationship so very, very close. Mm -hmm. And I'm so thankful, thankful, thankful for her, mm -hmm. um, especially after being gone for uh, over 10 years from wow. the home area and mm -hmm. now being back. Yeah. I'm just embracing the love from the hometown, the community, and I'm just very, very appreciative. Oh, that is incredible. Yeah. And so let's talk a little bit about the other business that you yes. have kind of focuses on the beauty side of things. What's that one about? Okay, so that one still needs, I'm still kind of figuring out my, mm -hmm. how to go with yeah. it. Um, it's more so fashion, mm -hmm. but I do, I'm dealing with um, lash, yeah. lashes. I've had that business um, name for over 13 years. Oh, Started wow. off um, um, working at Macy's mm -hmm. in the fashion department and doing makeup and mm -hmm. kept that name. And it like, again, it wasn't until the year of COVID that yeah. I'm like, I need to kind of, you know, work with that, mm -hmm. you know, believe in myself and help yeah. me grow that brand. So it's a fashion brand um, and it started out with my lashes. I do have a pair here. <laughs> They're icy lashes and the name, oh, how behind awesome. that, the, the name behind that comes from my niece. Um, oh, wow. My name is Iris. Hi. <laughs> um, and my only niece, and, um, and she's icy. Her, her, her parents, my brother and his wife, they just always keep her um, Looking fly. Yeah. So, yeah, I just got that name for her, but that's one of the fashions. Mm -hmm. And I want to get more into it um, by bringing unisex brands and offering yeah. different varieties. So that's something that I'm still working on. Mm -hmm. But this good and pudding here is my baby. This is your baby. And so, <laughs> yes. how can people get their hands on delicious stuff like this? Like, what is in front of us? Okay, so I do have. Uh, my good and pudding cups, mm -hmm. and then I have cake pop donuts with different oh, um, wow. flavors, and I have different toppings on top, and those are with bananas. And then I have my sugar cookies with banana oh. flavor, with yum crumb uh, banana flavor. So Holy the little crumbs cow. you see on there comes from a business called Yum Crumb, uh, mm -hmm. Yum Crumbs, and I think they were fe featured on Sharks, maybe. Uh, last year yeah so it's a great business as well and I've been been riding with them since the start of their business and it has been a great enhancement on my desserts and my customers love it oh my goodness I feel like I need to try something real fast yes. which one which one should which I try yours what oh you I don't try. know which, let's try let's try the banana pudding because great. that sounds like that is the go-to this is so awesome so you are on Facebook is that how people can find out more about you yes I'm on Facebook and I'm also on I have a website Q natural goodlook.com um you can go there mm -hmm. browse it um 
I am in the process of updating yeah. that as well. You can leave donations, leave remarks, comment, anything to help me grow as a business. Yeah. I greatly appreciate it. So. Oh, well, this is delicious. <laughs> Holy cow, that banana pudding is amazing. Thank you, Thank you so much for joining Thank us so on your birthday. This is wonderful. Guys, definitely check them out. Good and Pudding on Facebook. You won't want to miss out on this banana pudding. It's so good. <laughs> we'll be back in just a bit. Thank you.